Hello and welcome to episode 6 of my home renovation series. If you've not watched my videos before, hi, I'm Emma. Me and my husband have bought this three bedroom semi-detached house, which was a bit of a surprise project. So anyway, updates to where we are at the moment. The plasterer has finished his job, which I'm so happy about. And just looking around, I'm just so happy with the results. So I'll show you the results now. So in this room alone, he's plastered around the fireplaces. Um, so we can just paint those and eventually we'll get a wood burner in one. If you did see my video before this, I kind of gave you a bit of a floor planner impression of what I see this rooms or these rooms being like. He's also plastered around the dividing wall. If you go right back to the start of my video series, then you can see there was like a weird wood skirting around this. So that's all come off and this has been all been plastered around now. So that's all just bare wall. There was also a hole in the kitchen which has been patch repaired. So we just need to paint this kitchen ceiling now which is looking good. In every other room he's been filling the holes around the place which we've got out you know picture hangers and nails and screws and dado rails all of that kind of stuff. A few ceilings he's also skimmed so he's skimmed the ceiling in the living room, in the hallway, in the landing, I think that was it. Yep yeah, that was it. Also in the bedrooms, there was a couple of cracks in the, uh, two of our bedrooms which have been skimmed over and repaired now and just look like they blend into the walls. I'm just so impressed with it, really happy. And so where does that leave us now? We're gonna tidy up the whole place because it feels really dusty and dirty and we'll, we will hopefully start painting maybe this weekend. I'm so looking forward to just being able to paint but um, we might have to put the brakes on it a little bit just because we need the carpenter to come in and do his job so we don't want to make the place messy again whilst we've got wet paint on the walls etc. So anyway it might be a bit of a quick video slash update this week but yeah we'll see how we get on. had a general tidy around, a lot of hoovering, a lot of wiping and a lot of mopping as well. Already feels a lot better and I feel like on a sunny day like this you can really imagine what it's going to turn out like. So yeah, feeling really happy. We're going to sign off today. I don't know, it doesn't seem like we've done much but we'll be back here tomorrow and doing some sanding down and getting off some of the wallpaper um, which were, was behind the radiators so yeah when I thought that all the wallpaper was off not yet <laughs> so yeah we're gonna do those bits tomorrow right we are back at the house today and David's just scraping off the wallpaper which has been left behind the radiators I'm gonna attempt some sanding of the walls oh, there we go. <laughs> uh, just to prep them for painting really but I think I'll only just stick to a couple of rooms because our main bedroom for example, we've still got a load of wood in there. So yeah, this is all the carpenter's wood um, for him to start on his task. So I kind of don't want to sand around that, so I might just leave that for now. So yeah, let's see how it goes. Again, after all my sanding. I've just finished off this little room and actually I'm quite happy with how smooth the walls have came out to be so that's good. I think I am going to leave them painting this weekend though. It's Sunday and we're actually going away tomorrow to Centre Park so that's quite exciting. So I just need to tidy up around the house and I need to get some of my clothes out of the boxes to, to be able to have, you know, a more of a variation of clothes for centre parks. Like I moved into, well we both moved into David's parents in March and now it's June and the weather's changing so yeah I need a change of clothes. Anyway I know this week has been like a really quick update, I, I don't feel like there's been too much going on for me to be able to, uh, you know, vlog and stuff. 
So yeah, I'm sorry about that and you know, even I feel a bit like I want to get a start on this really, but I think next weekend once the carpeting has been round, yeah, there'll be a few more things to show you. Actually, I do have something to show you downstairs, let me go get it. So yesterday I ordered some, well actually earlier this week I ordered some power sockets for, so my brother can start putting those in around the house. It's nothing too exciting, I've just gone for the classic standard ones. This brand is MK, my, my brother said that that's quite a good brand, so I just went for some classic white ones. I was tempted to go for chrome or, you know, metallic ones, but I thought, you know, I don't know if they can look a bit tacky if they're not done well, and I thought the white ones just, they go with everything really, don't they? So they're going to go around the house, but next to our bed upstairs, the two power sockets next to our bed, I've actually got the MK ones which include the USB cable, uh, USB ports, so I thought that was quite handy. We had those in our old house and it was just really handy to plug in things like our Apple Watches and what does David have? A Fitbit. <laughs> you know, that kind of thing really. So that's exciting. We'll actually be able to have power again in the house, in different rooms and not just in a couple of different sockets. So yeah, that's about it really. I need to head home to pack for Centre Parks. I hope you've enjoyed this vlog anyway, although I think it's going to be a quick one. Let me know if you have by giving me a like and if you want to keep up to date with this house renovation where I promise you there will be more things happening in next week's vlog, probably a lot of painting I'm hoping. Yeah, if you want to keep up to date with that, please subscribe. And yeah, I, I think like if there's anything you guys want to see whilst I have these kind of updates where there's not a lot going on, you know, maybe there's some other things that I can show you or talk about, then let me know in the comments below. I would love to hear from you. But other than that, I hope you all have a good week, guys. I'll see you next week. Bye.